Alex is Rosalind back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time stopping by my channel, much love to you and welcome. And to my returning subs, my growing extended beautiful family, just thank you so much for the loving vibes that you send me each and every day as I do the same for you. And, you know, going through these tough times, we truly need, you know, to support one another. So I'm glad we're able to do that, especially in this community. So with that being said, Said much love to all namaste love and blessings love and light and many blessings are definitely coming your way and if you have been watching my videos for a while and have not already please what are you waiting for like and subscribe even hit that notification bell so you know when your girl's about to upload her next video also if you are comfortable enough please go ahead and drop me a line or two. I love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of my video or if it's just about your impact, the gift, and how it impacted your life and heading you towards a positive direction. I had a brain fart, y'all. <laughs> My bad. Uh, if the video is giving you good vibes or good information that you would love to share with a loved one, family, or friend, or even a fellow impact there are going through some trying times right now, need words of encouragement, please go ahead and share. And while you're at it, give me a thumbs up, like, and also share on your social media favorites wherever you see fit. My pause for this cause, y'all. My bad. My bad, y'all. I had to put some lotion on my hands. My hands were feeling real dry. It was aggravating me. I'm going to about to fall down. Um, yeah, my bad. But, um, yeah. Thank you for the love and support that you're giving me towards my videos. And I hope you're able to resonate with them. I hope I didn't skip anything on my outro. But if I did, my, my bad, y'all. It was just like my hands were really aggravating me. Um, my meditation music that I'm using today is called Release All Your Anxiety, Tension, Wash Away Negative Energy, Pure Clean Energy, Zen Meditation. I'll post that link in the description box below. And my video today is about Hey Oka Sips. Meta, uh, sense activation your psychic powers and higher state of consciousness is on 10 yes I don't know about y'all but you know like I said y'all go ahead and send me you know your your validations or let me know that you resonate with the video and stuff like that because it's like like I said this morning it since the activation has really been going on since a few weeks now it's like things have been very intense. Um, but first, before I start that, y'all, I apologize for getting emotional on my, on my last video. I mean, it was like between the meditation and I felt all these vibes from like my loved ones that have passed. And I kept on hearing, hey, you're doing a good job. Or, hey, you know, you're really doing good. We're proud of you. And I kept hearing that in my head. And I'm like, oh, you know, stop, please stop. You know, because it really had me emotional. So I do apologize for that. You know, I told y'all I hate crying and stuff like that, especially on camera. It is just like, ugh. But anyways, um, you know, in that beautiful moment when you when you're having loving vibes and caring vibes, you know, I don't know why, but my energy, well, I know why, because it's like I feel like I'm evolving right now. So you probably, if you've been with me for a while, you probably noticed my my energy is like very coming off very strong right now. And you know, I said I want to be able to share that with other people, but I'm just in this loving state of consciousness right now, and it's like um, since the activation feel like everything like you don't have to be having a psychic gift or anything like that but it's just like you're becoming more aware of everything around you uh you're knowing when things are going to pop off or you know when good things are coming your way and it's like everything is on another level like everything is really intense right now towards you so you know if you're feeling certain type of energies or vibes are coming your way don't worry these are things that are elevating you making you evolve becoming more aware and um this uh really beautiful thing right now it's just like like with me I'm, you know i have this medium psychic gift and it's just like everything is so intense to me right now it's just like i feel love from all my loved ones that have passed or i feel love from people that are even you know in my life they're bringing that towards my way and it makes me feel so humble and so blessed because it's just like when I feel this I want to be able to give it to other people you know because it's like we're always going through something and it's like we try to find positive things towards that day you know there's some people that you know stay in that negative state of mind but I'm so glad I'm attracting <laughs> people that are going through you know they're going through things but they're trying to see a better light for themselves they you know we try to keep constantly telling ourselves um better days are coming you know you might have a good day or 
you know, just enlightenment day, you know, because it's like I told y'all, people that I'm connected with, especially on Facebook or whatever, I always, you know, try to send them uplifting vibes, or even if I'm not, you know, connected with y'all on Facebook or whatever, Messenger, you know, if y'all send me some emails, like I said, everything's been going so crazy. I have not checked my emails in the last couple of weeks. So I do, I know I need to check and make sure if anybody sent me anything that I can be aware of it. But, um, you know, being able to know that we're on our next level of consciousness, everything is becoming very acute. I think that's what they, you know, I heard the word acute, but it's like very like potent right now. So you're probably feeling everything. You, your your emotions are all over the place. Um, you can get a little bit aggravated, but then it'll switch you back off to happiness, or it'll make you feel joyful, and then it'll get you aggravated again. And then next thing you know, it's like a push and pull situation. So knowing you're having to go through this right now, because whatever we're heading towards, it needs us to be able to clear everything, but you know, send awareness as well, going through these different things. Um, if you're in a twin flame relationship, you're probably getting more different connections between you and your twin, uh, more uh, metaphysical. Obviously, that was true because I just had a notification popped off real quick as soon as I said that. Um, like with me and my dad, it's just like so much loving energy going between us. You know, there's sometimes I feel sad when I when I feel him and he's like, oh, baby, please don't be that way. And I'm not feeling that anymore. And I'm hoping it's just not for a brief period. I want to stay like this. Um, as long as I have anything to do with it, I really want to stay like this. But it's a beautiful feeling when you can be able to share that with other people. You know, when we're going through things, you know, we need that love and support. You need that validation that things are going to get better. Even though you might not be able to see it right now, there's things that's working off behind the scenes right now that we're not aware of that's working in our favor. I don't know who needed to hear that, but... They told me to say that, um, as well as for myself. There's things that's working out that we might not be aware of. We're going through these really tough times right now because darkness doesn't want to see us go go through this joyous moment right now. So you might be, you know, having a conflict with things from your past that keeps popping up on you and it makes you want to think about it and then it pushes it away as well to let you know, hey, you know, you need to concentrate more on this positive thing because you keep concentrating on that negative stuff you're going to bring negative vibes towards your way so you need to go ahead and convert whatever negative thoughts you're having thought patterns into positive ones but there's a lot of positive things that's going on in our lives that is like really coming towards our way that's conjuring up in a beautiful way so it's just like right now like you know you've been with me for a while i've been i'm starting to be more open with the universe more open with them you know I asked them you know hey can you send me some content if you want me to do videos today if you need me to relax take a day of rest allow me to do that but it's just like it seems like I can do videos probably two days back to back but it's just like the, the vibes are so intense with me at times I'm only able to do like seven or eight videos within that day and then I have to take a, a day of break you know, because I, I feel like I'm going through so much and I'm recycling so many different things and I'm filtering out a lot of things as well and releasing a lot as well. So that's taking a lot of my energy in and out like that. But I love doing what I do, being able to get the, the messages and sending it off to y'all to let you know, you know, if these things, if you're you're going through right now is probably making you focus on a lot of things that has occurred to you it could have been recently or even things that happened a few years ago or you know towards your childhood it's making you reflect on those things but it's making you filter them out you might not see it that way but that's what they're doing if, if a lot of you are going through that so when they're telling me to tell you that I'm gonna go ahead and tell you so um, I know I've been having to do that a lot lately and it's just like, you know, I tell my dad, it's like I can feel him holding my hands. And I'm like, Daddy, I'm tired of this. You know, you just don't know the things that I went through. Um, and wanting him to know that. But I know there's things that he, they're not, the universe is not allowing him to know. Just like, there's things about him I don't know everything about. So, you know, being able to do that and reflect on a lot of good things that's coming on in life. Because I feel really blessed. Because it's just like... 
dealing with y'all, letting you know these things are going on, and then you, you're, you're reciprocating that and letting me know, hey, you know, I resonate with these things, I'm so grateful for your videos, and y'all don't know, like I tell y'all all the time, y'all be having me cry, because it's just like, when I know I can bring that joy and happiness in somebody's life, and letting them know, hey, you know, things happen for a reason, but it, you know, that pain gives us so much strength to be able to work harder for the things that we want to work harder for like there's times where I get frustrated and I'm just like like I say am I doing enough am I you know doing a good job you know I always wanted my dad to be proud of me you know even though he might not know what I'm doing you know higher self or whatever you know he knows what I'm doing but you know I feel blessed to be able to do the things I, I wanted to do and being able to help people in ways that I'm not realizing I'm helping them it, it's a humbling experience so, you know, loving what I do, it's not like looking for any kind of monetary value or whatever. What I do, I feel like if I'm going to be blessed in abundance with monetary value, it'll happen in its own way. But I say I'd rather do what I'm doing and not expect anything in return, except just seeing that y'all are happy and seeing that you're, you're okay and you're getting the things that you need to get to rely on you know, to let you know that, hey, you know, I'm going through this, but at least I know I'm not alone going through this. At least, you know, there's more people out here that's like me, you know, because at first, you know, going through this situation of enlightenment and going through a spiritual awakening can be a very scary experience, especially if you don't have anybody there to let you know this is what you're going through. You know, it can be very scary. You're breaking out of rashes, skin, you know, skin shedding really bad, hair probably shedding. Um, having you know being very fatigued and you know wanting to sleep half of the day or you feeling drained or having vivid dreams and lucid dreams and it's just like really crazy your emotions are all over the place that's a scary thought when you don't know what's going on and being able to put that meaning to something that you're like okay this is what this is that's a very comforting feeling even though you might feel like you're going through hell but just to know there's others out there going through the same situations as you they might not be affected in the same you know affected towards the things that that has happened to them but they're being affected in the same way they're having to go through all these things we're going through these things for a positive process i keep telling people that that you're going through this because you have to go through a process you know there's a lot of people like um probably are not taking medicines or probably seeing doctors like they used to they finally know okay the doctors is not going to be able to tell me what's wrong with me these are a, a spiritual uh changes i'm going through you know people will probably look at you and say when you go to a doctor hey i never heard of this before or, you know we're running all these different tests and i keep running all these tests on you raising up that bill that you really truly don't want to have or even afford for something that is like mystical changes you're going through so being able to know all these beautiful things that are occurring that they're bringing a big gift to you um, being able to know that there's something big coming towards your way from all the hell that you've been going through. So I hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video. Like and subscribe. Let me know, you know, if you're feeling this way. Um, I love it when y'all give me comments and let me know, hey, I, I totally relate to what you're talking about. That's a beautiful thing. And all I'm not doing this for myself. So uh, drop me a line. I would love to give you a shout out on my next video. And I'm giving a shout out to... Uh, Laura Hander, um, Harrison, Sydney Ann, and Janelle Bautista. I hope that's her last name, Bautista. Uh, much love to you. Like and subscribe. Hit that notification bell. Drop me a line. Share the video. Give me a thumbs up. And remember, subscribe and hit that bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. And I'll see you on my next one. Peace. Be wild. Mm-mm. Bye, y'all. <laughs>